Hi there, this video is called Live Utopia Weather COVID-19 UK 2020. If you like this video, is it? Please click the thumbs up. So, we're talking about the future weather guys across the Northern Hemisphere for the summer coming this year, 2020. Oh yeah guys, it's going to be very hot, no hot year guys, across the Northern Hemisphere, across the Northern Hemisphere, no hot year across the Northern Hemisphere for 2020 summer. So, it's going to be very hot and dry June this year across the UK. Potentially 35 Celsius, no joke about that. But hotter still to come, July across the UK will be 40 Celsius. Oh yeah, 40 Celsius, maybe, maybe 42 Celsius in August. This is my forecast, this is my prediction. If I get it wrong, I get it wrong. But every year it gets hotter. It's very warm today. Okay, not as hot as it was in 2018, where we reached a temperature of 29.8 Celsius. That was the 19th of April. That was incredible. I predicted that and I got it right. I'm better than that. This is always 85% right about the world across the UK, no joke about that. And uh, the same across the rest of Europe, it's going to be very hot. We're talking about 48 Celsius in Paris, high in August this year, July, and 55 Celsius in the city of Madrid in Spain. Yes, with the same high temperatures, COVID 19 will be killed off once for all. This will not last for much more until about July. This crisis will be over. The governments of, the, of, the, of Europe can't get, all, can't get everything shut forever. We have rights and freedom. Who knows what's going on there, if it's real or not? Fake news, who knows? But if I tell you the truth, if I see someone with COVID 19 and I really, really, really believe it's real, then I'll tell you. But everyone's surviving it. No one. It's dying, it's very mild across the UK. France might be worse, so Spain might be a lot worse, but the whole the social media websites have just been negative, they've not been positive, and they're not helping guys. So they're stirring up a hornet's nest against all the politicians across Europe, they're known across the UK at the moment. They want a total lockdown across the UK. The social media is just make things worse, and that's the BBC One News, ITV, yeah, ITV One News, and BBC, well, obviously Channel 4 News, and other channels like Channel 5 News, they're all up to no good. They're in trouble. They're trying to stir up all these days. I wouldn't trust them. Don't trust social media. They're in trouble. Journalists are in trouble. They don't do the truth. They just like to make things up and make it sound worse and they like to cause trouble. And quite frankly, they should be shut down and locked down for at least two weeks. They're in trouble. They should get a taste of their own medicine. Because as true reporters are fed up with them and they are in trouble. This is my town. This is my talk about it. The weather's going to get better, guys, and everything's going to be right. Not everyone's going to lose their jobs. Everyone's going to be all right. Be positive. Be happy. Because this is what I call happy hour. And everyone's happy. And everyone's happy. And no one's dying out there. And it's not like oh, the COVID 19 deaths out there. Been growing in some countries across the country, sorry, that right across the UK in general. So if you like this video, please, please, give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. And the force, we with you always. Great by Swat, there is many out there, there is the few. Because I'm always 85% right about the weather, let alone COVID 19. You can't always worry about these things. Enjoy your life, get out and about, and do your life. And don't worry about the government bringing tight restrictions in. You see, there's not enough police, not enough army. It's only 20,000 army, 50,000 policemen. There's over 8 billion civilian public people in the UK. That is a fact. We're all free to be alive. We're free. Be happy. Please leave a thumbs up, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. Like the one.